everybody, it's Amy from Amy's Animals here and today I'm going to be showing you how to make your very own Heidi house for any animal that can fit through the hole really, whether it's guinea pigs, rabbits or even cats, maybe rats or hamsters depending on the size of the box or the t-shirt. Here is what you're going to need. A pair of scissors that can easily cut through cardboard, a hairband or an elastic tie, I'm just using this little hairband, a fleece blanket or a cushion, this can be one that your pet already likes to use or you could just buy a new one specifically for this purpose. And you're also going to need a cardboard box that is big enough for your desired pet. You could use a much smaller one if you wanted to use it for hamsters or a bigger one for cats. But this size, we're going to use it that can fit guinea pigs and rabbits in or maybe even my cat as well. Lastly, you're going to need an old t-shirt from your dad or yourself. I'm sure each of your dad's parents, like carers, will have an old short sleeve top that they can donate you for your animals. I know my dad has loads of old tops that he used to throw away, so I went and asked him and he's given me this one, which is a grey one, so quite a nice colour for it. It doesn't matter on the colour or the size really, as long as it's probably like a large or an extra large, just so it can fit over the box. The first thing I'm going to want to do is cut off all of the flaps around the outside. It'll be easier to turn it up this way to actually get the top over it. We're just going to want to take the top and finding the head hole, placing the actual top over the box like you're dressing the box. So once you've got it over the four corners, you're just going to keep wanting to pull it down. Once it gets tight on the top, you can turn it around and start pulling it over the top, just like this. You've got to make sure that the hole for your desired animal is in the appropriate place for them. For like a rabbit or a cat, at this height you'll be alright, but for little guinea pigs with little stubby legs it might be easier if you have it a bit further to the ground like that so they don't have this higher to jump to your desired place. Then you just need to tape turn the box over, grab all of the pieces and then grab your hairband and tie it around the top. like that and you can cut all this off or you can sew it up but just for a quick and easy project you can just leave it tied like that. Now another thing you could do is where the armholes are you can cut a hole, push them through to make another hidey hole but I only want one with one opening so I'm just purely going to tuck the sleeve in itself just like that so it's not fucking around and it's into the side. You just need to try and fold your blanket to fit on the inside of the box. If you wanted to spend a bit more time on the fleece on the inside then you can trace around the bottom of your box and put it in and also you could layer a piece of newspaper on the bottom for it to last longer but since I have such a thick fleece just shoved in there then we won't need newspaper on the bottom. So here you have your quick five minute Heidi house, it doesn't take very long at all, it's out of all materials that you should already have at home and then you can just go put this straight into your enclosure or on the run in the grass or in your bedroom for your cats, depending on which animal you're going to do, just put it in for them. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you make this, don't forget to tag me on Instagram, my Instagram is the same as my YouTube, Amy's Animals, and I can't wait to see your pictures of your pets using these.